Hi, I'm Greg. Welcome to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be making micro RC airplanes that you can fly basically anywhere. Recently, Horizon Hobby has announced this new thing called the Inductric Switch Air. What it is, is it's an airplane built around a tiny whoop. What a tiny whoop is, is just like a little micro drone meant for indoor flight. I'm going to be using the Beta 65X brushless whoop. It's basically a tiny whoop on steroids, but it's kind of expensive. So what I would recommend that you use is the Ishin E010 because it's like $20. It's basically pocket change and it's a good way to get into the hobby. What I'm going to be doing is just using foam board and this tiny whoop to make a micro airplane. Now enough talk, let's get right to it. So first of all, measure out 12 inches. That's going to be your wingspan. It's time to determine how wide your wing is actually going to be. A healthy width would be four inches at the extreme. So let's just mark that. Okay. Nice. Grab your little whoop over here and just center it right about in the center of the wing. So in this case, it's six inches. Trace a line in the middle. There you go. You're gonna have to cut out a hole for this. So. Now you have like a little slot for your whoop. It's going to go like that. Now, make the wing more triangular. You don't want to make this too uh, narrow because then it won't provide any lift. A trick that I've learned, you can just take this piece that you've already cut out, take it off and uh, lay it down on the other side and just cut along the edge. That way you get the general, like it's not gonna be completely symmetrical, but it's gonna be close enough. Don't throw out these scraps because they'll be used as vertical stabilizers on the wingtips. Now you have the general parts. It's time to fire up the hot glue gun. So for this step, you have to apply some glue to the wingtips over here. And then grab these little winglets over here and glue them on. And just let it cool down a bit so that we can move on. See, it looks like a delta wing, more or less. This is the part where you actually attach the whoop to the airframe. What you have to do is take a scrap piece of foam, cut a straight line. This is gonna be used to create an angle. Cut that little piece in half. Now you sandwich these little tabs onto each other. Let's grab some glue. Just a little bit. You wanna be very conservative because glue does weigh something. It might not seem like much, but for a tiny whoop, it's quite a lot. Just a little bit, the bare minimum. So now just mark the spot where the center or the middle part here is with your marker on both sides and quickly apply some glue and take this and glue it on. You can see it has a pretty decent angle, about 30 degrees. That's about how much you want it to be. So let's just uh, stick this on. It's done. Let's try this thing out.
Oh, just a boat. <laughs> so that was fun. The wing definitely changed the behavior of this little drone. It tended to want to go straight and it felt lighter when going straight. So that means that the wing was probably creating some lift. It was kind of hard to maneuver, especially on the yaw axis. So like that because there's so much more mass for it to turn around. So you know what? Make sure to comment down below. Would you do this with your whoop or do you leave it stuck? If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. That really helps the channel. So make sure to subscribe to my channel. I will be releasing videos weekly. And yeah, happy flying.